The Pokemon franchise has made its way into many different forms of products and media throughout the years, from the games, shows, trading cards, and even toys. But what if you could hunt these Pokemon toys to be shiny? Well, that's the premise of the community event called Rumble Weekend. Started by Matt, aka Absol Blogs, about two to three times a year, the community gets together to all hunt for shinies in the old WiiWare game, Pokemon Rumble. You see, unlike most spin-off Pokemon games, the original Pokemon Rumble for the Wii implemented shiny Pokemon, and it's kind of implemented perfectly. Every Pokemon you encounter has the 1 in 8,192 chance to be shiny, and if you manage to find one, you're guaranteed to collect it. On top of that, the in-game collection displays all the unique shinies you found. Now, Pokemon Rumble originally only featured the first and fourth generations of Pokemon, but with a special mod created by Absol Blogs, you can have access to the second and third generations of Pokemon as well. I'll leave a link to the mod in the description of this video. However, as this is my first time participating and I had just got back into Pokemon Rumble only a couple months ago, I really wanted to focus more on the Generation 1 Shinies that I needed. Before I start though, I wanted to show off my current collection of Pokemon. These are all of the Pokemon I have and the Shinies that I have obtained in the save file, and I will show the final collection after the compilation is over to see all the progress I've made. And if you enjoy this obscure shiny hunting video, please let me know by leaving a like on the video and subscribing to the channel. Both are completely free and help me out a ton. Also comment below if you participated in Rumble Weekend and how many shinies you found. Yeah, no shiny for her, very sad. I do have three of them already in Pokemon Go though. I got really lucky with Furfru when it got released as a shiny. My first one, I think, took me like 20 encounters to get. My second one took me like 50 encounters. And then my third one took me like 100 encounters. And now I'm like 400 in since the last one. <laughs> but I just got super lucky before. And I, I changed one of them to the heart trim because now you can change it to the heart trim for the first time ever. For the shiny one at least so i changed one to the heart trim i kept one as a natural form but i kind of like the trims more so i changed one of them to my is that's it i think that's it that's it that's definitely it that's definitely a shiny oh my gosh yes let's take a picture ah that is definitely a shiny bell sprout oh my gosh yo all right, let's get rid of all these. I I noticed that right away. Look at him. Get out of here, execute. Look at his little leaves, man. Oh my gosh, first shiny of Rumble Weekend. It took 203 runs, which is like over 21,000 encounters so that's cool and it's not my target but it's a new shiny it's a shiny i don't have i'll take it we gotta do a trait guess i'm gonna guess it's gonna be hardy that's my guess brawny bell sprout let's go Look at the comparison. My first shiny of Rumble Weekend, shiny Bellsprout that I was really worried I wouldn't notice, but we noticed it. Pretty cool. We'll take it. I don't think this is a shiny. It might be. Oh! <laughs> That was a shiny mighty bell sprout. What the heck, man? Where? Well, the pop off began, but it was the duplicate, dude. Only 14 runs since the last one. I really didn't think that one was gonna be shiny. I didn't. I couldn't really get a good angle of the leaves. I mean, we'll take it. We're. We're up to two shinies now, and that was a fast one. I just, like, I really want the Pidgey. Wait, wasn't the last one... No, the last one was Brawny. You thought maybe the Shadows were doing something weird? Yeah, so, like, for me, when I was hunting for it, I Shinoed myself more times than I could count. 
But as soon as the shiny showed up, I knew immediately it was there. Combat breed. Nice. Yeah, I don't have the combat breed yet, which is crazy. I was shocked I got a, uh, a blaze breed first phase. I have a feeling I'm going to get like seven combat breeds before I get the aqua breed, though. <laughs> Oh, shiny executor! Yo! This is like sort of a reclaim for me! Yes! I told you the pop-off was happening! Back in the day when I was a child, I found a shiny executor. It was before I really knew what shinies were. And this was something I really wanted because I didn't I don't I deleted the save file, so I, I don't have it anymore. Uh, it doesn't look like we're going to get the comparison, but look at that. All right. I'm going to guess it's going to be Dark Guard. It's Speedy. Let's go. Can't really use it. It's so weak, but Speedy's cool. Man, we, we, we really out here getting everything except our target. Stuck. We gotta get another shiny. Oh, we we did! <laughs> oh my gosh, shiny, shiny weeping bell. Let's go! That was so fast. We've been live for two minutes. <laughs> shiny weeping bell. All right, I think I think I gotta call it here at this on this area. Even though I didn't get Pidgey, my target. We still got something we needed, but oh my gosh, look, I mean, look at the comparison right here, at least. Look at that. Perky. Perky Weeping Bell, wow. There we go. Perky Weeping Bell. You think they'll say, uh, oh, I think they'll probably, well... If it's gonna be soon, then they will probably say on Pokemon Day, but they didn't say on Pokemon Day last year. Oh, shiny tentacle! No way, man! No way! <laughs> We're doing so well! Only 17 runs for that. Look at that! Alright, I'm gonna guess... It's gonna be... Uh, rally is my guess. Can we get a comparison? No. All right, let's just kill it. I'm guessing rally. Ground guard. Honestly, not a bad one. Only 17 runs for another shiny. This is five shinies in a day. <laughs> Oh, oh, let's not do that. <laughs> I almost did it. I have, I have yet to do that, though. Because half of its face gets covered up by the... By the description, the summary. Look at that. You low-key like the Barney colors? I don't think they're bad. I just think the... I just think the new one is way better. As basic as that sounds, I think I think the current Charizard we have is just infinitely better than than the old one. It would have been it would have been cool if they kept it like that though. I always thought it would be cool if like I mean this is something they would never do, but like in Pokemon Go they always do like random like stupid like costume events and like stuff like that. It would have been so cool if they had like an original shiny Charizard event in Pokemon Go. I wouldn't want it for main series because then people would be like, make a new shiny for every Pokemon. And I, I'm not a fan of that idea. Because because Charizard's the one. Oh, shiny Firo. Yo, Dude, we're going crazy. No way. Shiny Firo after 34 runs. Let's go, and it's something we needed. Unfortunately, not the Victory Bell, but let's be real, I was not expecting Victory Bell. They're, they just do not show up enough. 
I'm gonna guess it's gonna be... Uh... Rally. Healthy! And Techie. I don't really know the, the Firo. Or the, the traits by heart. Dude, look at that. Dude, we're, we're going crazy today. Six shinies? In a day? My record before this was two. We did kind of pop off yesterday, though. You can see shiny Arcanine before Rapid Ash. Yeah, I feel like, I mean, between Charizard, Arcanine, and Rap- Oh! <laughs> shiny Charizard, dude, let's go! <laughs> Woo, we got one! Look at all the Charizards! And this one's a bit different. Healthy! Look at that! Facebook as a concept was cool back in the day. But like the idea of adding people as friends, it was very, is a very weird concept nowadays. Unless they changed it. Because now I feel like nowadays it's more about like following each other. Oh, there's a shiny Paris. Yo, shiny Paris. That's definitely shiny. You can see how dark it is. Look at that. 37 runs. It's healthy. I think the last one was healthy. Look at that. Oh, these ones are great. These ones don't even get covered up by the menu. I don't know. We don't even know for sure what the shiny odds are when you have multiple players. It's theorized that every additional player you have adds an extra shiny roll per Pokemon. But we don't really know for sure. That would be the logical assumption, and that's probably what it is, but people don't really know. Oh, Shiny Ghastly! Nice! Now we just gotta not die while we admire it. Shiny Ghastly! This is one my cousin actually has, which is crazy, because until now, we had not gotten a single Shiny that the other person has had. Dragon Guard Ghastly. Let's get a comparison. There we go. Nice! Look how happy Machamp is that he won. Yo! Shiny Ghastly. Let's get it. And we would just reset until we got a Sandstorm. And then I would hunt. And like, there were times where the Sand... Oh, Shiny... Shiny Vulpix, let's go! We got one more shiny! Nice! Just under odds. I was just saying this doesn't really happen, but we got it just under odds. Very bright. Feisty, feisty Vulpix. And then we got a comparison. Let's go. And there we go, shiny Vulpix. I, I predicted the Vulpix too. I said I was going to get Vulpix. Sparkling Bulbasaur. Bulbasaur is like crazy bright green in this game when it's shiny. Bulbasaur is all, has always kind of had a pretty good shiny. The only thing I wish they would change is if they made the eyes yellow like the rest of the line. That'd be cool. And then for some reason in Pokemon Go, Bulbasaur is like really green normally. So the shiny kind of gets lost. Even though it's still pretty obvious. But Bulbasaur has always been that like kind of like tealish color. And when it turns shiny, it's like a bright green. Oh, shiny Bulbasaur, yo, we, we manifested it, <laughs> let's go. Shiny Bulbasaur, we're just talking about shiny Bulbasaur and we get shiny Bulbasaur. Hey. All right, it's gonna be punchy. It's lucky, nice. And then we got a comparison, let's go. Only 45 runs.
This was the one I wanted the most here. Look at that. The comparison. Because I have grown to just love Venusaur so much. And I've always loved Charizard. Oh, Shiny Machop, let's go! That was so fast, 26 runs? In C rank? Yo! I just killed all of them. It's gonna be... Hardy. Perky! I forgot that was an ability. Boom! Look at that! What two shines did I get? I got... I just... Oh! Well, we just got a shiny Nidoran! After seven runs? Are you kidding? That's the fastest of this weekend! Let me see if I can get a comparison one first. Or, or not. Alright, we got the comparison with the male one, I guess. Oh yeah, it's backing up. Where are you going? Where are you going? It's gonna be... Scrappy. Techie! Nice! Alright, so we got two Nidoran males here. But one of them's a little lighter for some reason. I don't know, it must be a glitch. I think it's glitched because one of them is just is just a little lighter than the other and like has whiskers. It's very strange. I don't know how that happened. Now the 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 only thing I still hate about the Megas is the way they did Mega Latios and Latios, and I think they're doing it again for Hoenn Tour, where there's like no incentive. Oh, shiny Spiro! Let's go. This is the one I wanted. Yes. That took a while, man. 100, 189 runs. Shiny Spiro. Completing a lot. This is a, the first shiny line we've completed in this game. Spiro and Firo, and we did it this weekend. I'm going to guess it's going to be Ground Guard, because that would be so bad for it. It's Scrappy. Let's go. Wait, 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 hold on. It's scrappy, meaning a higher critical hit chance. There we go, we got it. We got the comparison, all it took was the shiny. This is a cool shiny. I, th I think Spiro is a cool shiny. Everyone just hates it because it's very common to find in mainline games, which I agree. But I think Spiro is actually a really good looking shiny. Here we go. With the comparison. Like, look at all these Pidgeys, man. We gotta get one. I I honestly, I'm gonna be I'm gonna be completely honest. If I is that that's a shiny bell sprout. You're you're joking. It's a gutsy bell sprout. I mean, it was fast. <laughs> it was like, come on, all these Pidgeys too. At least it was fast. That was one of our faster ones. Oh my gosh. Yay. Okay, well, because that was so... I mean, we hit 15 shinies. Because that was so fast. I'm just going to keep doing it this way. Oh, see, this is better. That's a lot more Pidgeys. That's what we want to see. No, not, not that. This. No, not this. S sort of this... What, what are, is execute actually the rarest one? Like, I was kind of under the impression that they were all pretty much the same odds. Is that it's another shiny bell sprout? I'm just gonna let them kill me. I'm just gonna let them kill me.
What are the odds I get a fifth shiny bell sprout in a row? I still haven't even killed the shiny one. There it is. It's gonna be hardy. Feisty, yeah it is. Yeah, it's feisty. <laughs> well, now I gotta hunt for a bell sprout. True! I gotta get a bell sprout. <laughs> That's what I need. I need to go for Bellsprout, man. Uh, I think I'm just gonna quit on the Pidgey for now. But yay. Oh, we got a Pidgey too. Nice, cool. Feisty. Oh, shiny Psyduck, let's go. Yes! That's what I wanted! Well, I mean, I wanted anything here, but... Yo! 36 runs! Wow, we'll take that. Alright, whatever. It's gonna be... Mighty! Lucky! It's my second lucky. Let's go! And... Shiny Psyduck. Again, shiny Pikachu. Not a subtle shiny, but a disappointing one. Actually, I've grown to kind of like shiny Pikachu. I think it looks better in the later games, though, than in the older games. It's It gets, like, a kind of a really nice, like, orangish color in the later games. Except for Let's Go. For some reason, Let's Go shiny Pikachu is, like, not it. I don't know what they did, but they just, like made shiny Pikachu in Let's Go like a more saturated version of Pikachu. And it just, it's not as cool. It needs to be that like orange color. Oh, there's a shiny Venonat, no way. What? Four runs? Oh my gosh. <laughs> Look at that. That's the quickest one of, of Rumble Weekend. That was faster than the Bell Sprouts, too. Oh, that's so sweet. It's going to be Dragon Guard Brawny. Oh my gosh, I can't believe that just happened. This is also the best day I've had for Rumble Weekend. Eight shinies in a day? Eight? Oh my gosh, look at that. Oh, that's so cool. That is so cool. Dude, I could like keep running this area too. Well, that's it for this shiny compilation from Rumble Weekend. For my first time ever participating, I think it went really well as I got 18 shinies, which was just incredible, and I started filling out a lot of the early pages in the collection for shinies. Again, if you made it this far into the video, please consider leaving a like and subscribing to the channel, and let me know in the comments if you participated and how many shinies you got. Also, let me know if you got any Rumble Shinies just in general, even when you played when you were a kid. I used to play this game as a kid all the time, and I ended up getting a Shiny Executor, but I didn't have the save file anymore, so the Shiny Executor that I got is definitely one of my favorites this time. But that is going to be it for this video. Thank you guys so much for watching. Make sure you like, comment, subscribe, ring those notification bells, all that good stuff. Be sure to join the Domination, and I will see you in the next video.